Hey guys, this is Debrow. I need to put this before my video of how to get Netflix in front so that uh, I basically left out the first and most important step you need to do. You need to go to Settings, Applications, and check this box that says Unknown Sources. This is very, very important. So I'll see you all later. Hey guys, this is Debrow, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get Netflix onto your Samsung Galaxy Tab or really and truly any Android um, device that doesn't natively support the Netflix app from the marketplace. As you can see, Netflix is running on my Galaxy Tab 7 inch by Sprint very well and I'm going to show you how to do this. Um, okay, so we're going to need to get a couple of things from the internet and the first of which is we need the drivers for the um, for the USB on the Galaxy Tab. Well, if you click on the link, it's going to bring you to this page, which is the Samsung website, and you need to install the USB drivers right here for Windows XP, Windows 7, and so on. Um, and just click this little highlighted link right there, and it'll install the drivers. Run that. I already have it installed, so go ahead and run that and after you're done doing that we are going to download the second file which is the Netflix APK again again click on the link and we're going to scroll down the page until we get to this Netflix APK right here is not the one we need this is the one we need right here this has worked for me on all the devices I've tried and uh, if not go back and try one of these but like I said this middle one right here Netflix dash device check dash disabled dot APK uh, works really well so once you've downloaded that you're going to need to plug in your Samsung Galaxy tab into your computer and I gotta put the camera down for a second so I can plug it in alright so I've got my device plugged in and the first thing that's going to come up on your Samsung Galaxy is USB connected and you need to click on this connect storage to PC you need to get this to come up some applications will stop using da 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 just hit OK so down there you see it thinking and thinking and thinking and it's going to let you connect your device to Windows and it's going to say now you can disconnect or whatnot but right now you're able to access it and as you can see on the computer it is now a removable disk so go ahead and open the folder and move that Netflix device check disabled APK into this SD card do not put it under any of these like Android Digital Editions, Android, Foursquare, Kindle, whatever you've got on there just leave it out on the main one that is where you want it to be so just move it from your downloads folder directly to here and once that's done you're done with your computer so now we're going to go over to this once it's transferred and we're going to click on disconnect storage from PC now it's disconnected you can go ahead and unplug it from your computer and now we just have one or two things left to install um, actually just one thing left next we're going to go to the marketplace wrong button. We're going to go to the marketplace, go up to your search, type in installer. Okay, once that's done it's going to pull up a list of them and the one we want is called app installer right here. Um, the other ones may work, but this is the one I used and found really easy to use. So, once you've installed that, click on open or just go to it, whichever is easier for you. And it's going to bring you to this. And if you scroll down, you will now see the Netflix device check disabled APK. Click on it and run it. As soon as it is, as it is done running, it is going to have installed it to your apps. And we're going to go to it right now. Let's get back to my home page. Well, now, go to applications and find your Netflix app. Now, the only annoying thing about this is it constantly goes new version of application is found. Do you want to update? 
I keep hitting cancel because every time I hit OK, it brings me to the App Store and there isn't a native Netflix app that works for the Galaxy Tab quite yet. There is some for the 10 inch one and the Motorola Zoom and the iPad and all that, but somehow this one got left in the dark, probably because it's running Android 2.1. But once it's installed, um, you can access your instant queue, search, watch videos, and all the good stuff that you're used to doing on Netflix. This has been D Brown. Please don't forget to subscribe and see y'all later.